playing Evil Within. Hi! Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs> so, it's Omar, John, and Brendan. Uh, we're just going to play this game for, I don't know, about an hour. And we'll see, see where it goes. We'll see where that goes. We're talking about dreaming. This game kind of has a dream element to it, but I won't I won't get too into it. I, I did watch a little bit of it, and yeah, I'd agree. I yeah. Li I, I like this, uh... John, John's on the remote. It's kind of PT-ish, looking back on it now. Okay, how's the, how's the uh, voice acting? In the game? Yeah. I think it's okay. I mean, I haven't Do I benefit from putting the voice in Japanese? Yes. We would probably benefit from okay. it more so. Baguettes? <laughs> 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 it's up to you, man. This is your call. John's on the controller. Oh, there's no Japanese. Suck my oh. ass, bro. Wait. I, I wanted to hear the main character yell Yamero. <laughs> Yamero! <laughs> okay, I guess we're going French, right? right or right. Spanish. We'll, we'll go baguette and then baguette uh, or taco. show. Um, tutorial show. Okay, that's fine. Gra you got you got to you got to see the letterbox just in the beginning. If you hate it, you, you can turn it off, but I I played the order with That game it has letterbox. Really? It actually looks really good. Oh, okay. I like I liked it. Okay. Well then, yeah. I just remember that when this game came out, it was a huge state of contention that like people were like, "You can't get rid of the letterbox." <laughs> And it was really bad. Holy shit. Until you can... Until... Uh, Fuck. Like... Mm, none door. of them. No, uh, <laughs> We're gonna see none of them. Okay. Oh, boy. So, casual or survival? You're not fucking casual. Not fucking casual. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here. Casual. The fuck. But yeah, I wish I could have a lucid dream, Brendan. Like... Like, I've been aware that I'm dreaming, and then I usually just, like, die or well, something. You can induce it. Mm -hmm. I know, that's what people say. They're, they say that, like, if you write down your dreams and you read them back, mm -hmm. you'll be, like, you'll pick up patterns, mm -hmm. and that way your body, like, your mind will subconsciously know, like, hey, I'm dreaming. Yeah. And then yeah. you can, like, spawn whatever. Yeah. Ask Marco. He almost did it once. He yeah. almost did it once? Well, he said he, he actually kind of did it here in my, in my house. He said, he said he was just, like, lying there on my couch when everyone was asleep and he was, like, doing it. And we all just kind of wake up and look over, and Marcus got a big old lucid boner. <laughs> <laughs> well, damn, good for him. Oh shit, forgot the baguette. Wait, what's it sound like? Qu'est-ce qui se passe? L'appel a été lancé avant que je passe vous prendre. Sound that bad? What is it about other languages that's funny? Everything. I mean, it's not that funny because I actually know what they're saying. Yeah, I was gonna say you went to baguette land. You, 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 you kind of speak it, don't you? Yeah, yeah, I, I can, I can, I could survive in France if really? you threw me in. Huh. But I'm impressed. But like, if you know Spanish well enough, like if you can read and write Spanish, you could, you could talk to someone who speaks French. Really? You could communicate enough to the point where you know you you can understand each other because they they follow a very sim similar grammatical structure almost to the T, and they share a lot of uh, words and um, phonetics. So even if the word doesn't sound similar phonetically, how it's said, like makes sense. And like syllable wise, and you can assume what the word means, and you're like, oh yeah, okay. Oh, okay, fair enough. Same with Italian. Oh, okay. If Italian and Portuguese, that's even more. Like, you can do, It just borderline sounds like Spanish. So, I'm not really sure what what's going on right now. I think we're on a call and to some, like, psych ward. We're a detective, and we just got a call that there's a situation going on in a mental hospital. Right. Are you skipping? Or do no. you care? No, I want to watch this. <laughs> it's tempting fate. <laughs> the most infuriating <laughs> shit on the internet. I'm going to look at it. Is what? The trophies. All right. It's when people are, you know, sitting around shooting the shit with a game and the instructions are very clearly plastered on the screen and then they disappear after like 10 minutes and then they'll be like, whoa, this game doesn't tell me what to do. What's going on? <laughs> Listen, let's not do that. I feel like we'll say that and we'll be aware of it and we'll do it plenty. <laughs> we'll do... Just, just play it straight. Look how cool you look. I wish I had a duster like that. I wish the other character was just as detailed. Modern day John <laughs> Marston. <laughs> oh, you're gaming now. You're you're in game. I'm gaming. <laughs> Omar, don't don't say that shit ever again. <laughs> <laughs> look at look at your code. It's getting wet. Oh fuck. This is next gen. <laughs> Can I see oh. The, the? Oh god. Water. <laughs> <laughs> oh my eyes are melting. <laughs> oh fuck the fidelity. This How is, old this is this game? Uh. It's gonna be three this year. Is it three years now? It's like, no, it's gotta be more than three. No, it's two. Uh, not even. It was 2015, wasn't Mortal it? Mortal Kombat X was two years old. This is... Where's the box for this game? Downstairs. <laughs> Damn it. Just look at your phone. All right. Time is weird. <laughs> it is weird. I'm sorry. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, your guys' name is Kidman? <laughs> Kidman. Kidman. Oh, is that her name? Yeah, that, it sounds a bit like an oxymoron, like saying Kidman? boy man. <laughs> or, or child adult. Do you ever remember Invader Zim? 
Yes. There was a, there was a character <laughs> called uh, Old Kid. Old Kid. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, I think I remember. How's it going? Dude, look at your coat. That's fucking sweet. Fucking sick duster, bro. No, I mean because it's getting wet because of the rain. It looks cool. <laughs> well, yeah, because it's a duster. <laughs> it's, no, it's only the it's rain. It's a fucking trench coat. It'd be a fucking gay-ass fucking... <laughs> like, who gives a fuck? It's just a wool coat. Dude, I like wool suits, though. Oh, yeah, they're fucking... I love them. Wool suits, yeah, are, wool nice. suits are nice. This game is pretty hard. Like, surprisingly hard. It's it's kind of tough in the beginning. All right. Because um, I got to have to beat this game at least three times to play it. Wahoo. Okay. <laughs> bing, bing, <laughs> wahoo. Look, it's Otacon... <laughs> <laughs> nah, I don't think that's Otacon. Oh, well, he's like uh, he's like our Otacon. I think. The Otacon of the evil. Is there an Otacon in every franchise? I mean, there has to be. Is, is uh, Slippy could, like the Otacon of Star Fox? Yeah, you could argue that like Navi is Otacon. <laughs> right? There's always like an informative character in a video game. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I suppose. Fee. Uh, oh, Fee. I fucking hate Fee. He's okay. Just charge your remote, charge your remote, remote. bro. <laughs> Why don't you take a break? Go outside. Why don't you shut the fuck up and stop judging my life choices? How about that? It's like that meme when uh, when Netflix is like, oh, you've been watching TV too much. How about you? What the fuck? I didn't. I wanted to go to the desk and it just steered me left. No, sorry, John. Can't escape these rails. That's bullshit! They didn't even forget, no, bro. It's a movie. John. <laughs> No, John. The, you don't. That's not. That's those old games. These are real video games now. <laughs> They're movies that you can interact <laughs> with. Oh, I still have control, bro. I can move How do you feel about those games, brother? They make me angry. <laughs> as long as real games always exist, I won't mind because I don't have to play them. Me too. Mm, okay. That's, that's how I see it. As long as they don't completely take over the format, I think I will be completely okay. Movie fags are coming to take away our video games. <laughs> hey, I live in a thin line between the two. <laughs> Oh look, it's caps. Even on the edge. I'm a film major, god damn it. Hey look, generic caps. Oh, are those good guys? Oh, oh, yeah, oh. Dead. oh look, it's caps <laughs> from Infamous. <laughs> Nothing personal, kid. <laughs> <laughs> Teleports behind you. Literally. Literally. You guys, did you guys play Infamous? Um, I remember playing it at your house like six years ago. Oh, cause I, when I first saw this, I made the same joke. I thought it was Kessler. <laughs> Kinda looks like the guy. Isn't it the bad guy? No, I think the spoiler is that Kessler is you in the future. It's like, Dude, spoily warning. Uh, fuck. So oh, like... I'm so sorry that the game from like 2008 is getting spoiled now. Oh, Kessler's Cole? Yeah, Ke I think Kessler's supposed to be Cole and he comes back from the future and he's like, you need to do better or something. Yeah, he is. Yeah, right? Is that it? Yeah, it is. Yeah. Ke Kessler takes off his hood and is like, I'm you from a future where you fucked up. <laughs> Don't fuck up, kid. And <laughs> I'm gonna kill your girlfriend so you don't fuck up. Oh, the game started. I'm getting a very Outlast vibe. Nah. Which came out first? Uh, at last. At last. Oh. Nah, dude. Whoa, bro, you think you need to get the knife? I know how to move Ooh, the fucking shiny. camera game. <laughs> oh, look, you're upside down. This and this are predicting. It looks like I'm standing on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> dude, you can see your feet in this it's game. Funny because, uh, no lie, I have a huge hard on. You're not paying attention. What? But I have a huge hard on for games where I can see my feet. <laughs> <laughs> you're not paying attention to what the butcher's doing. Oh no. It's dark as fuck anyways. Yo, who's fucking <laughs> fault is that? It's Whoa, realistic. Dude. It's cinematic. <laughs> Look, dude, you just cut that fucking body up. My this favorite movies are the ones where you can't tell what's going on. <laughs> hey, you can also see your hands. Like M. Night Shyamalan's Avatar. The I'm last insane, airbender. From my perspective, I'm standing. <laughs> From my perspective, gravity the police is evil. <laughs> Oh, dude, you lost your duster. That's, that's, the, fucking, that's the plot of the game. I would love it if, like, the fucking butcher had it on. Like, he took it off. You're like, oh, this is pretty nice. He puts it on. Instead of, where's my, where's my son? It's, where's my duster? Where's, where's my, my duster? Where's, where's my coat? What are you doing? I'm killing him. No, get the keys. Don't kill him, my dude. You're ballsy. Oh, I, I kept pressing square. You know, so many horror games can be broken by just having absolutely no fear at all. Like, just running at the bad guys, you maybe glitching leave. them into shit. He might come back. How do I run? Uh, you can't. <laughs> That's gonna be neat. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. I walk faster crouching?! <laughs> Isn't that how it is in Metal Gear as well? I think it's just because you're sneaking and you can move faster without making noise oh. while crouching. Oh. You should, you should maybe find your way out. That looks like a door. Try that. 
I'm actually digging the aesthetics. Oh, dude, this game actually has like pretty cool, like a like a tone going on. Yeah, I like it. I wish I could see it. <laughs> <laughs> I think our our viewers wish that too. Oh God. You, you know are what? such a dummy. John's dad's gonna check this out. This is gonna be the first oh, video fuck. he watches. Uh, better run, boy. Oh. Better run. Oh, how no. convenient that door was unlocked. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> Look how fuzzy the screen is. It's because the screen uh, film grain's on. Oh, right. The film grain is a thing. C close the door behind you. Oh, oh no. God. He just chainsawed your leg. Holy oh, shit. No. He's fast. <laughs> he's fast. <laughs> Oh look, he locked you in into the room with the blades. <laughs> oh my god. My favorite butcher has this <laughs> has this room too. Uh, oh god. Uh, this is scary. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. You can really feel the intensity. Oh no, I oh, hate shit. blood. You, you, know, you know what the worst part of this is? <laughs> All that fucking blood's getting into that gaping chainsaw wound he had. I yeah, this guy has AIDS. Yeah, I was about to say, this guy has AIDS. <laughs> he has AIDS. He has AIDS. Oh, oh has god, AIDS. yeah, AIDS. Mega Holy AIDS. Shit. AIDS. Every, <laughs> every bloodborne STD. <laughs> and bloodborne. <laughs> like, if the butcher don't get him, the syphilis <laughs> will, right? <laughs> I'm sure he. It's, just, it's in there. Yeah, he's, for sure. he's already dying. Oh, but it's okay. Your 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 shirt's still white. It's fine. Yeah, of course, <laughs> of course. Of course. <laughs> you carry a Tide stick. I was with about you. to say, like, <laughs> he washes his shit with Tide, dude. This that <laughs> this got stained fucking fighting power. This whole game's actually a Tide commercial. <laughs> at the very at the very end, he gives a thumbs up and he blasts. You're his cutting him <laughs> falling into the pit, coming out as a Tide commercial. <laughs> like he sub he comes up from the the blood pool with like a Tide stick in hand, like hand first. <laughs> It's just gonna go freeze frame <laughs> black and white, and it's like for the toughest message. For the toughest of stains, <laughs> tied. Oh god, the sewer water's getting into the chainsaw wound. Oh, this guy's gonna have fucking sepsis. I was thinking about his shoes. Can you imagine all the fucking gross shit that's in his shoes? If he I've got a gaping wound, dude. If he had his duster, he wouldn't have AIDS right now. <laughs> that duster would have been the difference between life and death. Du like. So is, when you become sexually active, doctors actually prescribe you a duster. Like, wear this. <laughs> wear this. <laughs> Don't worry, fam, I got you. <laughs> It'll protect Do me. I have to keep this on during intercourse? And it's like, whoa, what the fuck? You, do you just, you, what, you just carry it out in the street? No, you fucking wear it while you're fucking too. Whoa, bro, you have intercourse? What are you, gay? <laughs> <laughs> I bet you kiss girls too. <laughs> gay as <is> hard. <laughs> Look, plot. Oh, whoa. Beside the lock gate at the far end of sewer, there is a ladder which could take you to Old Ward. If you can make it through there, you will find elevator leading outside. You will be one who escaped. You might be one who survived. Art. Who is Art? John, the, the mic. <laughs> <laughs> so badly. <laughs> but who is Art? But who is phone? <laughs> <laughs> we both said it. <laughs> Where is that from? <laughs> from the bad creepypasta. <laughs> It, that's the it's like super like dumb and bad badly written and the closing line is but who was phone <laughs> the creepypasta was like I w was having sex with girlfriend and when got call on phone one day said hold on we'll get phone it goes goes over and answers phone and and man says what you doing with my daughter <laughs> And then he goes back and he says, your father was on phone. And she was like, but my father dead for six years. <laughs> so he said, but who was phone? <laughs> it's hilarious because you haven't committed to memory. <laughs> I only read it twice. <laughs> I couldn't even remember what it was about. <laughs> Thank God we have you, Brendan. <laughs> Brendan, we should do a series where you read shitty creepypastas. I would enjoy that. We'll be like all those creepypasta channels, but you'll only read the bad ones. <laughs> <laughs> Except we would be doing it deliberately terribly. So back to the video. Canada would be a war to oh, I gotta read this. Please, no. <laughs> John, have mercy. <laughs> Just don't read it loud. 14! <laughs> what is 1400? He, that? that man appeared. That's 2 p.m. 2. 2? Okay. He, that man. Get, you know, when I read notes like this in games, it's weird because it's like, do they actually put the dot, 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 or is that like your character just pausing? I infer it uh, as the pausing. Motive. Like they actually wrote they took that. the time to be like, he. Da, da, da. Just because they're fucking yeah. scientists <laughs> doesn't mean they can't have pros. One of them, one of actually, <laughs> one of them's actually a creative writing. <laughs> I was about to, I was about to say he, he's taking a creative writing class. Okay, give Every him some credit. Again. The Every fucking doctor that's about to be killed by a chainsaw murder and is leaving this last note to be found. <laughs> like, manifesto. oh man, I got to my wife and son. Got to add some ellipses here <laughs> for dramatic effect. I love them. <laughs> dot dot dot. God. Take care of the dog. 
Dot dot dot. <laughs> R. R. People who use ellipses on YouTube comments can fucking die. Why is that? Because it's always, they're always doing it condescendingly towards other people. They're like, you'd better get better taste, kid, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> yeah, I can't I stand bad. losers like you, dot, dot, dot. I don't get it. I, I you know what's like... wrong with the world, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> it's always Wait, an insult. Wait, thing. something's happening. Oh, oh, fuck. He oh, found no, you. it's me, man. You better leave or hide or something. <sighs> jump in the locker. The jump locker. in the locker. The locker jump. <laughs> Hobble over to it. I'm totally not in here. I was. I'm, I just. I'm having fucking Outlast flashbacks, like so hard. Okay, but what horror game doesn't make you hide in the locker at least like once? Resident. Wait, does Resident Evil? No. no. I don't think there's hiding in Resident Evil. New oh, one, I think. You. I think there's just running. I'm. I'm. Nemesis. I'm, very, I'm scared. <laughs> oh, this is Nemesis. Stop, stop wasting your field, jackass. <laughs> Dude, he's got a whole room full of chainsaw gas. <laughs> He actually just has, like, jerry cans buckled to his legs. <laughs> oh <running>. shit. <laughs> he has Capri Suns full of gasoline, and he just squirts one out into the tank occasionally. He sells all the dead bodies to Umbrella Corps, and he spends all the money they give him on Chainsaw Fuel, dude. That's all he ever wanted. I wouldn't be surprised if the director was like, this is in the same universe as RE. Like, I feel like that would maybe be a thing. Considering the lack of its success, he he's probably wants to disassociate. <laughs> Probably. Even yeah. if Resident Evil itself went incredibly low. Well, Resident Evil 7 did really good, right? Yeah. 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 Yeah, and he was he still worked on that one, right? I don't know, actually. Actually, no. no he, left he... Cap, he left Capcom after... Oh, right. That's after, unfortunate. Yeah, because this was, this was going to be his big break. This was like the return of the king, you know? Yeah. Oh, man. The king's back. Oh, fuck, John. Oh. Sneak put up. You, 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 you found you. You got to oh, get no. you. He gonna get you. You're dead, dude. There's no way. John, your AIDS leg can't tell. <laughs> your AIDS no, leg. No, I got this. I got this. Nope. Oh, oh fuck. <laughs> oh man, boy. We oh. 